The Buckeye Hills Regional Council is a local development district. It's a council of government. We can service all age groups, 60 and older, with our Area Agency on Aging programs. So we talk about telehealth, we talk about educational equity, we talk about digital parity, and that's our number one goal, is to really provide that support system and that connection to these federal, state, and local programs and resources for our people and for our communities. WealthWorks is an approach to local and regional economic development. The whole approach aims to connect local assets to meet market demands. The whole program itself looks to make sure that you are making your communities resilient, meeting market demands, and making sure that you're capturing your most vulnerable population to raise their incomes. The program allows you to do that all at one time. During the pandemic, we really saw that our national food systems and supply chains failed, and that led to food shortages across the nation for various products. We know that if you invest in your local food systems, you build a resiliency that allows more variety of products. And if it's local, you don't have to worry about shortages as often. And it really helps also raise the incomes of our farmers and our small businesses as well. We all know that Food insecurity and hunger is particularly a larger problem within the Appalachian region. And we also know that the increased cost of foods are impacting those populations that attempt to make their, meet their day-to-day -day needs with a fixed income. So if we can provide $50 worth of fresh produce, it not only improves health outcomes through the nutrition provided by the fresh produce, but it also improves health outcomes by ensuring that people have access to food. The Senior Farmers Market Program is a nutritional program that we implement across all eight counties within our region. Each spring, older adults can apply and they can receive $50 worth of coupons that they can use to purchase fresh, locally grown produce so they can purchase locally grown fruits and vegetables here within our region. So when the great Marietta tomatoes come on and when the river sweet corn becomes um, ready, those are items that they can purchase. The residents love it. It's, it's a great way to get that produce in their hands. You know, they're able to bake, freeze produce, can, and just enjoy that fresh food. Sustainable agriculture really plays a very large part in downtown revitalization. Many of our communities have really successful farmers markets, and a lot of those take place in the downtown centers of those communities. This is really a win-win situation for our communities because it is bringing folks into their downtown to take advantage of all of their assets while also connecting them to local businesses and the money they spend is reinvested locally. So it really is a dream pairing. By training our communities to invest locally in their farmers and build stronger local food systems, we are giving them the tools to empower themselves and to be more self-reliant moving forward. We see the food get to the consumer and help address hunger and nutrition. We see that money going back into the local economies, supporting small businesses, supporting people who live here, and not only impacting the income and the health of the older adults that we serve, but impacting the income of the families who run these small businesses. So it truly is a great program with a lot, a lot of positive feedback and it's welcomed every year.